Social play appeals to both the pro player and the novice. Part of that is the progression that we put through the game from a simple dash to a complex dash. It's the time trials and the, and the sort of variety of difficulty that people can make. And it's the approach we've taken to them. Using our companion app and website, you can customize your social profile, you can look at the leaderboards for your latest challenges, infinite possibilities of how you want to compete and when you want to compete. And the player can create challenges wherever they want to. We still have time trials, but instead of actually specifying the checkpoints ourselves, we actually let players do it. Being a truly skillful player was something we really wanted to tap into, something we wanted wanted to build on. And of course, we've created other challenges and other what we call dashes. A dash, at its simplest, is a race. Complexity and depth comes from discovering the right route for you and then mastering that from the beginning to the end. In most of our social content, we have a thing called Echoes, which is a sort of echo of a previous experience that someone has had on that race or that time trial that they've gone on. The visualization of it actually relates to uh, the beat. It's a uh, augmented reality piece of a lens that Faith is wearing at that time. So the beat is the system runners use to communicate in game. And we've taken that concept and created our companion experience, our app and our website. Another social element that we have is the beat LE, or the beat location emitter. And it's the ability for me as a player to place a, a geotag in a sense, uh, in a certain place in the city, and then for you to discover it or find it. And it's all up to you where you want to create this and how you want it to be played. You can make it easy or you can make it incredibly difficult if that's what you want. I can't wait to see what players will do with it. I'm super proud of the game. It's not only going to live up to their expectations, but immensely exceed it. It certainly has exceeded mine. Play it first on Xbox One with EA Access.